guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be taking care of the leaves and cleaning up the flower beds a bit. We had really hard frost the last few nights and the flower beds are just looking like they could really use some cleanup. So let's get going. Hey guys, how's it going? So today we're going to be working on cleaning up the leaves in the flower beds. While this will be the second time it's been done this season, between the flower beds dying back and we had a really hard frost the last two nights, we were in the 20s, and so it really looks a mess. Let's take a look and see what we've got going on and get it cleaned up. So as you can see, we've got a hot mess here and it's really just looking raggedy. And then we've also got all the leaves down. So let's get this cleaned up. It is still chilly out here today, but I'm going to try and get a little bit done. Let's get going. So while this was only the second blow of the season, what it did do is it gave me the opportunity to see what needed to be done, all the plants that needed to be cut back and if there were any issues as something like I noticed bulbs heaving, which then need to be replanted. So let's take a look and see how everything looks and you'll see what I mean. So all of the leaves were blown back here. This is just a lineup of crepe myrtles that I have and I just use leaves as mulch. But as we come here, you'll see this flower bed had so many leaves in it, but all of these daylilies now need to be cut back. I need to clean up the lambs they are here and we've got more over here that needs to be cut back and cleaned up. And I also see that I need mulch as during the summer when everything was full, I was not able to see where we were, but lots of cutback do he here. But seeing those leaves cleaned up, oh my goodness, it just makes it feel so much better, even with all of the cleanup that still needs to be done. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you on the next one.